Uh, now I will explain the second method for this question. Now for the second method, I use the pattern of the sequence and then to find out the general term of the sequence. At uh, first, we need to uh, think about of another. Uh, the, the, let me write down n to one, two, three, four, five. That is for the first term, the value is zero. The second term, the value is one minus one over four. Then we need to observe the pattern uh, or the relationship between the denominator and the n. Now you will see that when uh, n is two, the denominator is four. When a is three, the denominator is five. When n is four, the denominator is six. When n is five, the denominator is seven. Okay, so uh, it is quite clear that the denominator is given by n plus two. n plus two. Second, let's observe the uh, relationship between the limiter and the n. Now for or for the second term, it is minus one. For the third term, it is two. So if we ignore the negative, ignore the negative, then we can have uh, a minus one. Because the second term, a minus one will be one. The third term, three minus one will be two. The fourth term, four minus one will be three. Okay, so we are looking at the value of the limiter and the last term last term is about the negative negative how can we handle handle the negative is that now you can see the sequence uh, and is it is the alternative sequence actually if we give the CEO a, a a plus or minus that one should be plus okay although uh, plus zero is same as uh, and minus zero but if you give uh, see, uh, give the first term a, a plus or a minus, then it will be plus. So the reason is simple. Then we have plus minus, plus, uh, plus minus, plus minus, and then plus for the uh, terms. So th this is the pattern about the sign. And how can we uh, uh, write down the journal term? Uh, uh, I mean the the plus or minus in the general term is that I need to have minus one to power something. Minus one to power something. And the something and the something should be in terms of n. And I can tell you if the power uh, there are two types of the the, the uh, sequence for for example minus one to power n the first term will be minus the second term will be plus the second and uh, the third one will be minus and then plus and so on. However, for minus one to power n plus one, then the first term will be plus and then minus and then plus and then minus. Because when you put different values of the n, when n equals one and minus one to power one is minus, uh, negative one, and minus one to power one plus one is one, which is positive. Therefore, therefore, we should have minus one to power n plus one for the, uh, the to indicate the sign of the sequence so the uh, after we consider the numerator denominator and the sign then this one will be the general term so the answer is d that's all